One of the great joys that I have is baptizing new believers and baptizing folks who have rededicated their life that maybe was baptized earlier in their life. But they came to realize that they walked the wrong path, right, straightened up, walking the right path, and said, I want to do my first works over again. Has anybody ever been like that? Amen. Well, we have some folks who are candidates for baptism today, and I want you to rejoice with them as they enter this baptistry this morning. This is Christopher Eccles, rededicated his life to the Lord, came out of darkness into the marvelous light of the Lord Jesus Christ. He said, Pastor, I want to be baptized. My sins are forgiven, and I want my life buried the old way and resurrected new. Amen. Receiving Jesus Christ in your heart and life. Yes, God. The acknowledgement of Him as your Lord and Savior. It's been an honor today to baptize you in the name of the Father, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. This is Jonathan Post, Dana Baker's oldest son, came to me and said, Pastor, I want to be baptized. And he's rededicated his life to the Lord some time back and now has entered this baptistry as a public testimony outwardly of what God did on the inside. Baptize you in the name of the Father, yeah. and the Son, Hallelujah. and the Holy Ghost. As you know, last Sunday was supposed to be the Sunday we baptized, but the heater went out on the baptistry. It's fixed. It's fixed well. <laughs> and so we had three more to be baptized, and we will have another baptismal service for them. One had to be in the hospital, and two were out of town. But thank God for these today. Amen. And as you know, as you know, there's been quite a, a rage of, of uh, an outbreak of flu going around. And a lot of our people have been sick. Pastor Grant and Danny were unable to even get out of the house for a week. But he's back today, and would you make him welcome as he comes with our announcements. 